Thanks for joining us as coverage you can count on kicks off with all three suspects in custody after a home invasion and shooting. A break in that happened Saturday in the North Lake subdivision in Grovetown. A 19 year old shot in the stomach inside that home. Still no word yet on his condition. Today, though, investigators taking a closer look at the three men in jail and charged. News Channel 6's Devin Johnson live for us tonight in Grovetown. And Devin, I know you've been talking to investigators today. Brad, this is still an open investigation, so Samuel Long with the Public Safety Department couldn't exactly tell me what led up to the shooting, but he did say thanks to social media and surrounding law agencies, they're getting closer to solving this case. Three teens charged with aggravated assault, home invasion, and armed robbery. Grotown Public Safety Investigator Samuel Long tells me during the break-in, two men reportedly shot a 19-year-old in the stomach who was visiting the owners of the home. They came directly towards him. There was some altercation that occurred in the middle of that and that a single shot was discharged, uh, which hit him. A 15-year-old was taken into custody shortly after the incident. 17-year-old Tavarcia Steed was taken into custody during a traffic stop, and 17-year-old Joseph Bonner of Louisville was arrested on Monday. Long tells me social media played a huge role in capturing the suspects. People don't necessarily want to talk at the immediate scene due to fear of being identified or singled out by and then have some later uh, retribution happen from a uh, perpetrator. One person who lives in the North Lake subdivision says the neighborhood is usually a quiet area. A lot of military retirees live here. A uh, few active duty military live here. Mm -hmm. And it's basically a very quiet place. Now, she's encouraging her neighbors to get security cameras for their home. And a lot of them do. So it's a very good idea to have that. Grotown's investigator says the community is stunned by this violent incident. Anytime we have an incident of this type, uh, the whole city is shocked. Um, Grovetown tends to be a quiet, very safe community, and we work very hard to make it so. And Long adds more charges could be coming the suspect's way. Count on News Channel 6 as this story develops. Live in Grotown, Devin Johnson, WJBF, News Channel 6. All right, Devin, thank you. And all top